side of town, I like to go ahead and venture off into stores that I don't normally frequent because it is on the other side of town. So I'm gonna go into Trader Joe's and see what they have. Try to stay within a small budget because I go crazy in Trader Joe's, but I must say that their prices are fairly reasonable. Okay, so let's browse and see what we find in Trader Joe's today. I'm gonna try to um, vlog. I know they're kind of funny acting about that. I'm vlogging on my phone, so it shouldn't be that bad. <laughs> All right, let's go. All right, guys, so keep me lifted that I don't go in here and spend a fortune in Trader Joe's because, you know, I really don't need much. I want to get some fruits, vegetables. Keep me lifted. Let's see. Y'all, and before we go any further, look Remember on my nail video, I told you about the chemical burns I got from those baby, not baby wipes, makeup wipes. I had eyeliner on and some mascara that I wanted to remove and I used these makeup wipes I got from Ross. Chemical burns, look at this, y'all. Look. I'm so irked. So I have nothing on my face. So that's why I look all ashen. Um, and then when I do my makeup wipe, I come all the way down to the neck. Look, chemical burn, this was big. So this has been a week, y'all, of me with this. So I need to remember to buy some aloe in there. And I want like natural stuff to make sure that my skin is gonna go back evenly toned. Y'all, this has been like a week for me. I couldn't even touch my skin. It was just like fire. It felt like fire. So needless to say, um, no for the makeup wipes. It's gonna be um, very much back to um, cold cream, very old school. <laughs> but anyway, let's go. All right, homies. So yeah, Trader Joe's is pay. Like I always feel like a good wife whenever I do like Trader Joe's. Like I feel like, you know, a suburban housewife when I shop at Trader Joe's. I don't know. I mean, y'all know Aldi is my main squeeze. They are related. So Google, Google that, that fun fact. buy the whole bag of onions and they will go to waste so now I just buy what I need each week all right so some of the crowd has gone so let's take a look at what we have here I always get in trouble with this salad section I know I do need grapes and I'm gonna pick up some strawberries down below and tell me how you keep your strawberries fresh I always run into them getting moldy after a couple days oh, I'm gonna do grapes I think or let's visit something else I really have been loving the watermelon lately so we're gonna do strawberries I also want to do 
some burgers. So, let's get their ground beef. So I need um, lettuce, because I wanted to use lettuce wrap burgers. And let's get a salad blend. So let's do this. And then we need some lettuce for our burgers. I want a really firm tomato to get a good slice on it to make our um, lettuce wrap burger. like a sausage for breakfast. Let's see. Um, uncured chicken hot dog? Or should we do a smoking dewy sausage? But I wanted to eat uncured because we don't want any extra sugar. <laughs> So I'm not gonna buy it. So here are the berries that I love from them. Good in um, smoothies. I have some at home, so I'm not gonna pick up any. Your cauliflower mash. Seven grams of carbs, so I am gonna pick this up. And they have some rice cauliflower. This one is really, really good. It's like, an, it has like an Asian taste to it, and it's seven grams of carbs. So I'm gonna pick that up and it's $2.99. Um, the mashed cauliflower was also $2.99. Um, vegetable blend. Hmm. I have stuff at home, so I'm not really gonna pick up anything. I am gonna pick up their broccoli. It's $1.69 for the bag. Okay, so this is my absolute favorite section, is Asian. I love any Asian, like, that's my genre. This is really good, I usually get that. Let's check the carbs on it though. Don't think this fits in my macros. Yeah, it's 24. Um, this is really, really, really good. This is not bad. If I had a really good day, I could do this. And this is the Kung Pao chicken. So I'm gonna pick that up and I can have this with um, string beans. The shrimp stir fry is really good too, and that's $4.99. I can't stress to you enough, if you have a Trader Joe's in your area, please get to it. Lots of shortcuts. <laughs> I'm gonna make my own okay. Alright, so seasoning. This is one of my favorites. This is bay. I'm gonna get this 21 seasoning salute today. 
Everybody is going crazy over the Persian cucumbers. I've been loving those, and I usually pick them up from Aldi's, but it's the same price, and it's $2.99. So these are good. Babe usually likes me to do it with um, a vinaigrette, and I like dipping it in a ranch, homemade ranch dip that I make at home. This is also another yummy yum that I love to make, and this is broccoli, or baby broccoli. what I forgot guys I need to get like munchy items oh um, this is usually what I get oh wow now they have the everything but the bagel seasons smoked salmon but I usually get this for breakfast super super good very good on fats and I almost walked out of here without it I boil an egg and I'll do like a slice of cheese on the side let me grab um, a slice of cheese with really good fat. So I'm gonna get this for babe. We usually get the Orban Redenbacher movie theater butter, and that's tons of butter. So I'm gonna get this instead. It's only $1.99, so it's way cheaper. And I'm also gonna get a white cheddar. I was looking for some pork rinds, so I'm gonna have to get them from somewhere else because I don't see them. Alright, and then I need this. I'm doing another recipe. So, alright, let's check out. You going in? Go. <laughs> Good. Bucks, all organic. <laughs> Thank you. I love the 21 seasoning. Have you used it? I've never used it. I've used some of your other stuff, so I'm like, I need to try it. What do you use? What do you um put it with? I do it with chicken. I do it with. Um, I love it with sautéed spinach. It's okay. A great seasoning for that. Vegetables. It's definitely gonna have like that lemon flavor. To oh, it, good, good, nice. good. Okay. Um, but yeah, it's great. I mean, for salt free, it's yeah. I'm not. I don't miss the salt. Right. When I use it. Okay. It's yeah. Really nice. So that's what I wanted. I wanted to do like a um, cilantro chicken with okay, the with I the think chicken that thighs. Be, yeah. That would be great with it. I think that would be awesome. With the cilantro, I think that'll go really nice. I'm excited. Yeah. <laughs> Don't forget to thumbs up, subscribe, share, and comment. And hit that bell on the way out to make sure that you're up to date on all of our latest videos. See you soon.